What's up, YouTube? How's it going? I haven't recorded in a while, but here I got a first of a few dull battles that I'm gonna be recording throughout the rest of the summer. I'm gonna take a break from single battles for a bit because everyone else does single battles. Why not do other things? My friend leads off with uh, Ho -Oh and the Night Tales. I lead off with Gengar and Porygon Z. Mind you, this is street rule battles, so anything goes. You know, we're just having fun. It's not a Wi Fi battle, by the way. That's why you see a lot of level 50s here. So I decided to sucker punch that Ho Oh because I knew it was going to attack. Turns out, to my surprise, it's a Zorok. Then that Zorok proceeds to flank throw Gengar. Little does he know, my Gengar is really a Zorok in disguise. And then boom, we both left out with Zorok. That's how awesome he is. But unfortunately, my Zorok faints. Then, Porygon Z activates his normal gen and try attacks that Night Tales into Obliviation. So, we're both down one Pokemon, which is all fine and dandy because. Technically, I still have the slight lead since um, Porygon Z has full health. So next, I send in Hagar Haxorus, and he sends out his Reshiram. And I was like, "Oh crap, this is Reshiram!" But Haxor is Choice Scar, so I should outspeed him. And I do, and I start bringing down the house with Rock Slide. And to my luck, Rock Slide critic. So I was able to take Reshiram down all the way to the red. And surprisingly enough. Porygon Z was also faster than Reshiram and was able to take down Reshiram with a tri attack. So that played in my favor and now I have a huge advantage because he's down three Pokemon and I still have five left. So now he sends out his his own Blaze again and he sends out my Netric. And he here he's really at the huge disadvantage because again Haxorus is Scar. And then he decide, and then he brings down the house again with his rock slide. And then I decide to take out that mid nature because I fear that was going to be a, a more of a problem than uh, for my team than anyone than that blaze again. So I easily dispose of that. And to my luck, again, blaze again <laughs> flinch. So yeah, luck played in my favor for this match. Now he sends out his real ho ho who protected, which I figured that was gonna happen. So I decided to go after Blaze again with with Porygon Z. But first things first, I brought down the house again, leaving him in the red, which left um which left Porygon Z to be able to finish it off with a tri attack. So now it's just little poor ho ho versus a Haxorus and a Porygon Z. Don't know why people think this is. I don't, I don't understand the logic behind Mongon's tier list and stuff like that. I guess it makes sense for single battles, but for doubles, triples, and imitations, it has no merit whatsoever. So he tries to take me out. Did he take me? I think he takes me out with the Sacred Fire. Yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna survive Sacred Fire from a whole old in a sunny day. No. So I decided to send out my Cobolian, which I nick I renamed him after this battle. So in future battles you see a different nickname. And then I finished him off with a Rock Slide. So that was a great game with my friend. Friend again. It's a street battle, so we basically used any Pokemon we felt like using. You know. Once, once in a while, you guys should try instead of doing finally smart. Peace out.